Uh, Devin Haney won his last fight against Regis. Um, and, and, you know, accomplished another belt, uh, moved up to 140 uh, from 135. And uh, he looked really good, man. So we wanted to just touch upon that and talk about boxing for a little bit. So, Wild, what did you think um, about how Haney looked against Regis? There was a lot of hype going into the fight. Um, man. You know, Devin got a lot of hype. You know, how how you think he performed and what's next? For me, personally, I was one of the people who looked at Devin and was like, Oh, he's good, but he's not that good. You know, before that fight, you know, I watched a lot of his fights and I was like, he's good, but he's not like great. That <laughs> fight was a masterclass. Like, and I always have respect for Devin, like him going and fighting Cambosis in his country twice, you mm-hmm. know, fighting for less, fighting Lomachenko, and then going to fight Regis just now. Like, if you talk about resume wise, I don't I don't know if anybody can mess with Devin res- resume wise, cause He's done it, you know, and he showed he's not scared. But that fight against Regis, bro, he showed everything. Like, he showed that he had pop at 140. He showed the angles. He showed the defense. He slipped punches. He could fight on his front foot, on his back foot. Like, I don't know. Devin made me a big fan of that fight because I thought it was going I – I just didn't think it was going to be that big of a domination, but it definitely was a master class. And then – um. You see Devin calling out Tank. You see his dad calling out Tank. Like, I feel like that's... Go ahead. That's the one we want to see. Nah, I'm just... I mean, he had some some choice words for Tank. He tweeted about him, and Tank responded. So I feel like Devin's becoming a big draw. Tank's obviously a big draw. Like, this is the closest we've ever been to that Mm -hmm. mega fight that everybody's looking for. You know, Tank, Devin, Shakur, everybody's been talking about those three. Those three are so good, so... Mm-hmm. I'm thinking like, okay, this this might be the time where we get to see it. But I, I bang with Tank. I bang with Devin. I I really, you know, Shakur is my man, but I want to see that fight. Tank funny to me. He got that video where he's like, I'm going to rob some. Right. You know what I mean? <laughs> Baby, man, so I, can't, I know. I'm trying to see hey, that fight. Nah. Bro, How would you feel about it? I, I Like you said, man, I think Devin put on his performance at 140, put everyone on notice. Like, he came out there smooth. Um, and honestly, Regis, you can make the argument that Regis only had the first round. Because after the first round, Devin whooped his ass, bro. Now, you know, he put everyone I know at 140. You know what I'm saying? So now it's the him and Tanks, it's the him and Shakur, it's him and Tio if Tio decides to come back and fight. And I think that Devin, you know, if you look at the stats wise, he's solidified himself in boxing history from what he's done to the age of 25, yeah. belt wise. You know what I'm saying? 135 uh, undisputed, so th- then 140 got a belt. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's snapping absolutely. right now. He, he's snapping, so I think this is good for boxing. And now we want to see those, those big mega fights. You know what I'm saying? Like his resume, he's done what he's had to do. So now it's like shit. I think Devin the A side in a lot of situations. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, so now he gets to dictate in the terms. But and I don't think he's ducking. I think he wants to fight these dudes. And you know, a lot of dudes is picking and choosing, like Shakur says. So, I this, to me, I respect Devin. He fought Gambosis twice in Australia, beat him twice. He fought Lomo. You know what I'm saying? When people would duck Lomo, yeah. you know, it was a contract fight, but he still won. So then he looked at 140. So it's like, bro, I, I got to give it to Devin right now, bro. Yeah, nah, he got to. I think, I don't think the next fight for Devin can be like one that's not big. Like, I think it has to be Tank. It has to be T.O. It has to be, mm-hmm. you know, I don't know if he's going to fight Shakur. The, the sad part about the situation is he was talking about going to 147 and Shakur is like a 135 pounder. So. I don't know if we're ever going to see the Devin and Shakur fight, but it's a lot of other dudes right. that Devin can fight that, that will be the mega fights, especially Tank. And they're going back and forth on Twitter. So so we're going you know, we gonna, we gonna to see what, what happened with uh with that whole situation. Um, it definitely can't be now. It's some fights that we need to see now. Yeah, nah, facts.